Hi everyone, I'm Diwa from Wiser Biker. In today's episode, I have got a pair of cycling bib shorts to show you and give you my user review on this pair of bib shorts. Now, it is the Van Razel RCR Root Bib Shorts from Decathlon. Uh... Now, here's a disclaimer. I am not a specialist or I'm not really into studying the quality and build of a bib shorts but here are my very own experience after using this bib for 3 months and the reason, there's a good reason why I use it for 3 months before I tell you or do a review on this product and that's because I want to really get enough data points to draw a conclusion on as well as I want to see how this bib shorts um, looks like after repeated uses washing then use and wash again and use again and well finally today let's see oh yes why do why did i choose a cycling bib shorts over a cycling shorts so there are a few reasons why i chose the cycling bib shorts over a cycling shorts and the top reason reason number one is that without the elastic band around the waist it actually helps me breathe better so it is more comfortable wearing a cycling bib shorts and the reason number two is that with these shoulder straps it's able to keep the sharma in position in the place that is near to be uh, whether i'm on or off the saddle well the only downside about wearing a cycling bib shorts is that now there are more steps to be taken there are more procedures to be taken when I need to visit the toilet to answer a natural call. Well, that is not something that I am used to, but it's just a small sacrifice that I have to make to get, you know, all the good things that these cycling bib shorts can offer. Now let's take a look at the overview of these cycling bib shorts. The main material of these bib shorts is 20% elastane and 80% polyamide, which is very common in cycling bibs and it also comes with a foam padding here let's take a closer look at them and we will see first at the design of these cycling bib shorts now this is an all black very clean look design with a white logo in front the van razor logo in front and also there is a small rubber tag at the side with the logo RCR on. I'm not sure if this is a reflective print, but even if it is, it is definitely not prominent. Let's take a look at how the gripper looks. And here is the silicone grips inside. Uh, it is not very wide. I would have I would prefer to have a wider gripper strip, but so far this is sufficient in doing the job of holding the trunks from slipping upwards the bib is formed by different panels sewn together and the highlight this the side panels is something i want to highlight to you they are actually perforated and this means that it is more breathable and hence it is more cooling at the quad area so i believe you can see it here pretty clear it's got a narrow back and a pretty much a Y-shaped design when it comes to the straps on the shoulder. Again, it is uh, perforated all the way from here, connecting the lower body trunks to the upper body straps. It's all perforated. You can see the holes all inside. Now, however, these straps are a little thin in my opinion i would prefer a wider strap so that the pressure can better distribute and uh, hence more comfortable when i strap it on my shoulders let's take a look at the waist area uh, again the material is make perforated so more airy here and the good thing is that this a raised area of the bib lies right below the belly button now, while some of the other bibs in the market actually cover the whole abdomen area, this design, in my opinion, is more hmm, toilet-friendly. 
The length of the trunk is, in my opinion, just nice. Uh, it comes right above the knee, which I think it is about the right place to be in. Well, next, let's move on to the comfort aspect of this cycling bibs. This cycling bib comes with a 2.5 HD pad with very high density foam, uh, which is the decathlon it claims to last up to seven hours of comfortable ride on the saddle. I have not tested it for seven hours straight. Now I've done for about four hours ride on this bib and I felt comfortable with it. So I'm very confident that I can stay comfortable for five to six hours on this bib. The chamois is made up of two separate foam with a relief channel at the center. Well, this design allows better blood flow at the groin area and also I feel comfortable on and off this saddle. Also, the size of this chamois is just nice and it wraps around my bum nicely so I don't look like a duck when I'm walking. Here, look, wow, I just simply press and squeeze these foam pads. You can, I can actually tell you that it is made up of different density at different areas. While this chamois is very comfortable to sit on, it is not thick at all. It is rather thin in my opinion. Next, I want to show you some detail, which is the hem where all these panels join. The hem in general is soft and it does not irritate my skin but it does leave some depression on my skin after wearing it. However, on the hem on the upper body portion are more scratchy and these straps are also too rough in my opinion. They are too rough, I mean for my skin. As for the sizing, I am 172 cm, 62 kg, and the recommended size is M. Uh, it fits well on me, which is why I think it's true to this size. Lastly, the value of this bib is 50, 55 Singapore dollars, which in my opinion is super duper good value. So in conclusion, uh, here is my honest user review to you. I think that this is a very good pair of cycling bibs. It is inexpensive and it offers a lot of quality. It is especially suitable for writers who live in warm countries like me here in Singapore. If there's anything that I would love these cycling bibs to improve on is that, well, number one, I would, I would love to have a wider contact area a contact service for the silicon gripper and of course um, <laughs> definitely i would love to have better fabric on these straps so that it doesn't it is not so scratchy on my skin especially on the sensitive areas on my chest well there are many better more sophisticated cycling bib shorts in the market but they are also much more expensive so if you are new to cycling or just pick up cycling and this would be a very good starting point for you. Alright, so thank you very much for watching this review and if you have come across any budget cycling bib shorts and they are really good quality and comfortable to wear with do let us know in the comments box below also we can get to know more about these great products. Thank you, I'm Diwa from Wiser Biker. Cheers!